Hello everyone and welcome to this Rackspace email and apps walkthrough. My name is Melissa, I'm with the Knowledge Center team, and today I'd like to take you through the control panel specifically focusing on Microsoft Exchange. The first thing you'll need to do is log in using your administrative ID and password that you were given upon your initial day of sign up. Go ahead and hit log in. And this is the control panel main page. Today we're going to focus specifically on getting set up with Microsoft Exchange. So I'm going to click More, and this is going to provide me with everything that I need to manage and administer my Exchange mailboxes. So the first thing I'd like to walk you through is actually setting up a mailbox for the first time. Click Add Edit Mailbox, Add Mailbox. You'll need to enter your user credentials and details here. And your password requirements are very stringent, so you want to make sure you have a green bar next under the requirements link to ensure that your password is secure. You'll also notice that Microsoft Exchange mailboxes are given 2 gigs of storage. The great thing about Exchange is you can purchase additional storage and allocate it to all the users you see fit. For example, I can start off with 2 gigs here, but then I can go in, add another 2 gigs, give one to myself and one to another user if I want to. Down here if you do want the user to have a Microsoft Outlook license which is the desktop platform from which to check the mail click that Microsoft Outlook license radio button hit save and you can see now my test account has been created. So I can see here from the mailbox administration screen all the accounts that are currently active the name of the mailbox, the last time that user logged in how much space that user is using and I can also disable the mailbox from here as well. One thing I'd like to draw your attention to is the mobile messaging link. So if you have Blackberry, iPhone, or Active Sync application, you can sync your mail directly to your device. To do that, you'll need to purchase a license, either Blackberry or Active Sync. This page will tell you exactly how many licenses you have and how many licenses are active. You'll need one license per user. I'll click the Rackspace Hosting link here and show you exactly how to add that license. Go over to My Account, Upgrade, Email Hosting, choose the domain. Now this is where you can add more mailboxes or extra storage, but specifically located here are the licenses for mobile usage. So you can use add as many licenses as you need and then hit continue. That Microsoft Exchange high level overview. If you have any additional questions, please start a live chat or contact our support team via ticket for additional support. Have a great day.